Hey, what's going on guys? Booster Whips here. Today we're going to be installing um, the window visors on the G70 uh, 2022. I found some really nice ones on Amazon. They are made in Korea, nonetheless. Uh, took about a one week uh, to ship, so it wasn't too bad. Um, they come in chrome uh, with a chrome trim and black or all chrome. Of course, I went with this. Um, if you guys know or if you've seen my YouTube channel, I went ahead and already um, blacked this out with vinyl. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna install over it. Um, you can choose to, if you have something like that, to take it off, put this on, and then go ahead and redo the uh, vinyl wrap on it. So what I'm gonna do is just gonna go ahead and put it over it, and then I'm gonna go ahead um, and get Entho's performance to come out and wrap these visors again to give it that nice stealth black look so um they look really nice they're pretty flat um onto the uh onto the trim so it's not all bulky i've seen a lot of uh, bulky ones out there um so i think this would do we'll see how how it looks once it's fully installed but um let's go ahead and get started the first thing you want to go ahead and do is you want to go ahead and clean the area um, they do provide two alcohol swabs. I already went ahead and took one out. You're gonna go ahead and clean the area, which I already did. Um, this is to take off um, any grime that you have on there. Um, the car is a little bit wet, it's been raining, but I went ahead and I wiped it down, make sure that everything is nice and dry. Uh, go ahead and clean it with an alcohol uh, swab. And then they also provide um, some kind of like a, the color super primer, I wanna say it's probably the same thing as adhesion promoter. Um, so this is to kind of bond plastic trims uh, with uh, with adhesive backing, So which is what this has. It has a 3M backing on it. Um, so we'll go ahead and pass that on all four trim pieces and then we'll start the installation and then see how everything looks. All right, area is clean. Uh, what we're gonna go ahead and do is uh, take this off. You guys know they're using a 3M, it also says here made in Korea. So you wanna go ahead and peel this ribbon, just like any other uh, trim videos that you guys have seen, you wanna go ahead and peel this off just enough to kinda of have this on here and then kinda of maneuver or help you maneuver into the right uh, position before you can even press and bond. So I'm um, gonna go ahead and place this on here. like so. And then as you're pressing, you're gonna go ahead and remove the ribbon and go ahead and press. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish the whole thing just to make sure that everything lines up evenly all the way towards the end. Uh, press and hold and that uh, completes that setup. We'll go ahead and do the back door and then the passenger doors on the other side and see how that comes out. All right, that fit very perfect. So you wanna go ahead and uh, push. I do recommend using a microfiber towel to avoid any uh, scratches, uh, you know, and then uh, just kind of push and hold, but it bonds right away just because after you put the uh, adhesion promoter, it comes really nice and sticky um, and it bonds right away. So. Um, perfect fit all the way to the end trim so it's from beginning to end looks very perfect I'm gonna go ahead and move the camera so you guys can see the other corner but it looks great so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you that now all right there it is all the way to the bottom I'm coming down here just to kind of press and hold on there but it's it's really nice it's very complete all the way to the bottom um, I've seen also other kits that just kind of come a little bit like halfway um, but now this one completes the entire trim from top to bottom. Um, so we'll just go ahead and do the, uh, the back door and then we'll do the uh, passenger side and we'll wrap this video up. All right, same thing. We're gonna go ahead and peel this off uh, just enough to start giving you some nice uh, leverage. And then uh, we're gonna go ahead and position um, and pull as we go so this is a little bit tricky there we 
go. Got it. Alright. So we'll pull some of it off. And we'll go ahead and position this where it goes. Nice and aligned. And then you're gonna pull ribbon and apply. So we'll finish this up and then uh, we'll see how that looks. All right, guys, there you have it. You guys can see that it has a nice little curvature. It's not too popped out. It looks real great. There's both sides already connected um, and it looks good. So throws it off because of the chrome. I think once I go went ahead and black it out again, it should give it a nice look. I'm gonna go ahead and do the uh, passenger side um, and then we'll go ahead and wrap this video up. All right, same thing on the passenger side. We went ahead and peel this off and then we'll go ahead and position and um, start um, applying. So I'm gonna go ahead and continue this, finish it, do the back door, and we're good to go. And there you have it, guys. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have any questions, comments, go ahead and drop them below. I'll put the link of Amazon, um, just so you guys are interested. I believe it was like under 90 bucks. Um, pretty good, great quality. Um, they provide instructions, they provide the alcohol pads, the adhesion promoter, and it bonds really great. Um, so. I've seen some other ones that bring some really bad 3M on it. Um, this one's really good. So definitely, I'll give it a 9 out of 10. Um, if you guys, uh, again, have any questions, go ahead and drop them below. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Boost the Whips. I'm out. Have a very pleasant day, and God bless.